What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, y'all, uh, apparently Lola Lee has a exclusive from uh, Krishan Nubu or whatever. And I don't I don't know who be having an issue with me doing reactions or whatever. So I just want to say this is Lola Lee tea channel. Okay, y'all make sure y'all check her out. And I'm absolutely going to put a link in my uh, description. I ain't got time. Um, but she got she has an exclusive in our hell. I want to see what's going on. So let's do it. This is Lola Lee T. Oh, shit. Hey, bad. everyone. How are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. So Krishan's new man, K Suave, reached out to me after he watched my video right here. Title was Krishan's new boo. K Suave has been claimed by another woman. We need answers. And I just wanted to say that I believe every word that he said so i'm gonna show you guys the um clips that he sent to me oh shit we got receipts let's just be friends i don't like, change. i didn't try changing my number like three different times and i don't know how but she finds out how to get my number and it's scary she didn't found out my address like a few different times like and it's scary, but um, nothing to worry about. The bitch never really, excuse my language, she never really caused any like harm or actual threat, but it's annoying. And the fact that she's 36 years old, acting like a kid and a child. And yeah, that's crazy. It's just like, it's, it's messed up. Her uh, brother, her uh, like brothers or whatever, they contacted me before and was apologizing and just saying like, yeah, like she's like messed up in the head and everything though, but the whole like she literally just texts my phone like I don't she and I don't block all her numbers. She didn't I don't block like seventeen different numbers, but she seventeen different numbers. First of all, y'all, she was live tonight, right? And I got everybody asking questions because girl, I got questions. Like, what's what is the problem here? I thought he was twenty years old. He's actually twenty six. Um, and I also was trying to figure out how the hell she got his number in the first place. And I don't know, hopefully this answers that, but it's like, bro, what she the... She literally texts me, like, 24-7. Like, I have so many text messages with her, like, conversating by herself. Like, I have over, like, 2,000, 2,500. So, nah. I just watched um, your full video about the stalker girl. Um, she's so weird, and it's just sad. that the He seems very educated. I like she's that. She's, like, like I said, 36 <laughs> now. She she literally said she would stop harassing me and calling me and texting me if I apologized to her for exposing. Because the message I sent you, the screen recording up, all the text messages I posted it on my story. And then I went live and I was talking about the situation. So she like, if you apologize to me, I'll stop. And I apologized so she can leave me alone and stop finding my fucking number every time I change it. And obviously she took a recording of it. Maybe um, she's getting his number via the phone company he's using. And I know that may sound crazy, but I mean, if you got Verizon and you keep switching via Verizon, then she still somehow is tapped into that network or sis is just really that crazy. And she did admit to being crazy. Um... I wonder has he tried to get his her what well, another number in somebody else's name, and if she got that number, bruh, hell no. Nah. I didn't know, but yeah, so that's how that went, and the bitch said it like four different times. So I apologize four different times, and I'm a goofball for even believing it, but yeah, so she's weird for doing that. But all of my fans, supporters, followers already know about shorty you feel me like this is something oh like it was there when she first got bought up you feel me like versus the new people that's coming in that don't know the situation so i f i feel that you feel me like, i feel uh, being curious and everything but she's just mentally ill like and wants attention and you posting her is what she's want. like she literally texted me from a different iCloud that i didn't block like the third one today she oh said, my Bitch, god we all about to be famous lol like you feel me that's all she care about like you feel me so 
Like, she's literally on that and will say anything. At one point, she was commenting on these people's pages saying that I'm her baby's daddy, saying that we got a kid. That was the crazy shit. I had hella people text them on my phone. Oh, like, my God. Yo, who is this? Like, and But they seen the messages, so then it was like, okay, you know, this bitch is crazy. And Krishan already knows about this girl. You feel me? We talked about it and laughed about the situation already. And she was with me one time when the crazy stalker girl started blowing up my phone. You feel me? Like, knows about the situation. She literally just wants That's attention. That's crazy. No threat at all. Zero threat at all. Trust me. No threat. Just wants attention. Like, like I said, the girl is 36 years old. Like, acting like this she just she wants attention and like i said posting that video trying to figure out who she is that's exactly what she wants no threat at all just a grown-ass woman that wants attention want to be important and won't and won't you mental illness is real so that's the last thing now but um you have a good night slash morning um bye <laughs> like, I didn't try changing. He seems genuine. My number, like. So I just wanted to let you guys know that I posted his reply to me with his permission. And I wanted to do that so that other bloggers would be aware of the situation before it gets out of hand. Ah, good. So um, I guess you won't have an issue with me reacting to it. I mean, I'm sure everybody got about to get a hold of this video. So this That'll will be, help her. You know what I'm saying? be the last time that I will be posting about this person that K Suave says has been stalking him. So thank you so much, K Suave, for giving us the answers that we were asking for. Let me know your thoughts, guys. And then in this one, he's basically showing me what he has been dealing with. Oh man. <clears throat> so who you ain't never been inside this fat ma. So who cares, nigga? Not me. Ignore me. So what? What the F I got to lose? Nothing. My coochie still ain't been touched by none of you niggas. I play on Instagram for jokes. In real life, I don't give a flying F about none. You could F or B in my face. I would spit on that hoe and laugh. Sex is a joke to me. I think you're funny. This good girl ish not for me. I'm turning up F this. I'm coming outside. If I was skinny ass, broke as basic, big nose, white hoe, you would have booked my flight by now. But since I'm actually a good itch, I got a big. Them basic hoes winning. I can't be basic. Sorry, it's impossible. I'm a genius. How many basic hoes have have to spend time with you man i just laugh don't take me nowhere i'm gonna hurt your feelings see how many white me stop me at the end of the day it's nothing for me to come to florida but boy f you you right there you're a joke i could easy find you i just don't care i know where you are i know exactly where you are i I could come anytime, but F you. Them hoes can have you. Uh -huh. Believe that I got six open cases in Atlanta. I ain't never showing up to court. <laughs> F12. I'm literally walking around with open cases. Ain't nobody said ish to me. <laughs> I'm a gangster in real life. Them cases been open for years. LOL, failure to appear. I ain't going, come get me. I'm a good girl now. I've changed. That's why I be laughing at you. This F nigga tried me, babe. <laughs> Next thing you know, I'm in jail. <laughs> so I got to go to court. But F that nigga be disrespecting me, I didn't F him or nothing. He just gave my number out to some white man threatening me, etc. So I pulled up and jumped out on the bench <laughs> He called the cops. He a B word. I think he was scared. His dad was scared. His dad was like, can y'all please make sure she never come back? I don't tolerate disrespect. Okay. Like this shit like a scroll. Like, you know what I'm saying? I didn't even like this person. Never effed him or nothing. He just tried me. So I got mad. I pulled up so fast. Like, huh? Say what? I got out of my car. Like, what the F you say? He was so scared. I went to his parents' house. They was all shocked. 
Like, what the F? I don't give a F. Try me. Why this nigga give my number out, though? Like, what? It gets old and people change when you're young. You're supposed to... Oh, shit. Wait a minute. What, what, is, what is that? I want to F every day. I be horny. I hate it here. I finally found someone I like, and I got to wait even longer. Oh, my God. Uh, oh, man. I think I'm somebody, LOL. I just laugh like, okay, I'm not even a celebrity. They treat me like one. It's weird. Like, I'm not even known, but in real life, people treat me like a celebrity. Like, I live a celebrity life without actually being one. I don't want to be one either. I never wanted fame. Fame kills people. Just give me my little money and I'm going to head out. And that lets you know she's not crazy. Um, the music industry, Wicked, this also lets you know she's not crazy. I've been here a long time. I know. Oh, my God. I guess people are something, but I'm sorry, y'all. I got to read. This is crap. Damn. It don't matter because it's a next scroll. Two minutes worth. Um. Uh, yeah, friendship shit cool and all, but niggas really, uh, if you die tomorrow, nigga gonna move on. Nobody gonna tell you, like, what the fuck? Uh, I'm effing up. I'm not letting you go. I don't care. I can't deal with nothing else. Uh, I support it. I'm supposed to protect you, I guess. At least I think so. Why me? Why I have a high responsibility on this earth? It's a lot. That's why I need dick. <laughs> Yo, what? When I was young, your age, demonic ass music industry, I was around them folks. I've been in this game my whole life, so I know. So I'm an angel of music, a good angel, but I mixed with a few bad ones. Then I started, oh, hell no. Nah. What? Oh, I'm, I'm, oh, hell no. Nah. They always messing with folks, them ass. Oh, hell no. Nah. You know, I don't do the satanic stuff. Um, the stars talk, they like to shoot down. There's that's their uh, girl. I don't even want to read this shit no more. This shit is crazy. He knows about this girl. You feel me? We talked about it and laughed about the situation already. Man, <sighs> y'all, I reacted to her life. You know what, though. I'm going to do what Lola said and not talk about her no more. Um, We're going to go ahead and head on out on that note. 1414 in the chat. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Um, Man. Man. You, when you think you've seen it all, you haven't. Bye.